what is going on? It is Obadiah, and today we are back playing some Paladins. And today I'm playing with a character called uh, Maldamba. Check it out. This is him, Maldamba. And he uh, he's a snake dude. He throws snakes and stuff. Look at it. Snake. Here we go. Watch, watch him throw it. Snake. So uh, he's interesting. I really, really hated this character. I really didn't like him at all at first. But now he's like growing on me. They made some cool changes to him, or one cool change really. So let's talk about his attacks. Your first attack. Oh, by the way, if you guys do enjoy this video, if you learned something, do me a favor and hit that thumbs up button. And of course, feel free to subscribe if you haven't done so already. So his main attack is, is left click, shoots a little thing. And see how it drops off really quickly? Doesn't have a big range. It used to be like that. <laughs> it was awful. It was made up almost unusable. Um, and when he reloads, he throws the snake, which does a stun. So check it out. I want to be like, Cassie, just chill. Stun. Oh, maybe it doesn't work on the bots. Well, let's go try it on like that, that pip that's over here or whatever. Uh, no, no, no. Okay, let's try it here. Stun. See that? And then you can just freaking load on them. So his le right left click ability does attack pretty quick. Check it out. It's like every half second or something. What does it say? Every 0.55 seconds does 450 damage. So that's just under 900 damage a second, which is pretty dang good as far as healing is co healers are concerned. Because he is a support class. Um, he doesn't seem to get a drop off from distance. But the force the farther you go back, the harder it is to hit. See, look at that. Look at that arc. I still can't even hit from here. Ugh. Yeah, so there is that. And then his F move is a little snake. It just lasts for like a bit. What is it, half a second or something like that? Uh, slither quickly forward and I'm untargetable for that time. But uh, it lets me get out really quick. And if there's cards that lets make that be uh, yourself able to be healed, which is really nice. Um, so he's got those and that's pretty cool. And then he has two healing abilities. He's the only support class with two healing abilities. And so let's check out what they are. You have your right click, which just zaps out a little laser beam. And that just heals over time. And that's the big thing with him. He's all about healing over time. Look at that. Oh. Uh -huh. It's like every three seconds you can do it. And he can also, that's actually perfect. I didn't even think we could test out healers on this Fernando right here. Um, so it does, how much does it do? 280 health every uh, second, every five, for five seconds. Okay, so look at it go. Look at, now I've got also a card that allows, I don't think I can, uh, him to, after there's already the heal over time on someone, the second time it happens, it uh, just does a flat 300. Otherwise, I don't think it stacks. Um, but that's cool. And it's good for like healing a single target, just consistent healing, especially if you combine it with your Q move, which throws down a AOE heal as well. So between the two, you can keep people healed fairly decently. I mean, this, is clear, this guy's dying clearly anyways. But, but see, we're keeping him up. We're, do, we're doing some job, we're doing some work. And the Gord, which is the Q move, it does 280 health and damages health for 200 damage every second. So I can throw it here and it'll do 200 damage a second while healing me for 280 a second. So between the two, we can do, what is that? 540 a second in healing, uh, which is pretty dang good. And if you use Kronos to even reduce the cooldown further, it's pretty much just constant healing. Um, really good for single target healing, and the Gord does help for group healing as well. And everything's pretty low cooldown, which is really good, and I've really been enjoying him. Um, so let's see, we did the left click, we did the right click, we did the F, we did the Q. Now it's just down to the E move, which is one of my favorite E's. It's a fear. And it only lasts for a couple seconds, but it's enough time to like really get some good damage in, and it's a really good move that will really help your team out. Um, in, in some really row. bad situations. So it's really, really fantastic. So overall, a really good character that I really didn't give any credit in the beginning because I thought he was going to be absolutely terrible, who ended up being pretty good. So what I'm going to do is set up a match, and we're going to go play just a casual match with him uh, and kind of test him out and see how well we do. I've played a few with him already, but not very many. And uh, hopefully we can do some good good work. Enemy, pray to your gods. All right, guys, we have one set up, a match, and this is the legendary card. So we have Gord now slows enemies in the area 40%, which I'd never use. Dread Serpent causes enemies to take like 20% more damage, which I've never used, because I go straight healer, which is healing a target already affected by Mending Spirits, which is our regular heal over time effect. Heals for a flat 500. And you go ahead and look at the cards here. I'm not going to go over what they all are, but there they are. I don't know that it's the best build or even a good one, but I like it. 
Um, there's lots of different options, the items you can choose. I personally like Kronos because I want to be able to heal as often as possible. Even though it's only, already only three seconds, um, being able to throw the Gord all the time too really helps. Uh, so, oh, this is Kevin over here, by the way. You guys have seen him in some of our other videos. He decided to join the round with us. And we'll see how this goes. I'm going to try to stick mainly with the tank, which any good healer should generally do to begin with. Um, but because I feel like an on-the-point single tank healer is really well mod on, but shines in the right situation. I mean, obviously he can't do it all by himself, but being able to stand here and just drop the heals on him, like so, seemed to do really well. Look at all that healers he's getting. No, no, just but stay with me, dude. I don't want to, like, you know... Heck yeah. See what I mean? Like, the longevity here is so good that it leaves plenty of time for the damaged people to go do their thing. Um, now, the only problem with this is that I end up never... Ooh, I just got freaking murdered. I, I end up almost never doing any damage with Maldamba, even though he does some good damage, and I think there could be some really good damage builds, and that's where I just need to figure out how to balance it properly. Um, that's not a fault of his. It's just difficult when the two heals are happening so fast. In fact, a lot of times I'll just hold down the attack button and hope to just get some random hits while I'm doing stuff. Um, let's see. Well, he's dead. Let's see. I can throw some heals on the bomb king here. Whoops. Get not too close. There you go, bomb king. Enjoy it. Where are you going, bud? I can heal you if you leave me. Oh, oh, ah, oh. Wow. Shaolin. Man, I need to play more Shaolin. I think he might be our next video. I, I really enjoy him, and I, I haven't played him nearly enough. Ooh, this is going... I, I, it felt like it was going good in the beginning, and now it's not. So I'm going to go ahead and do the smart thing and wait for the tank to get back. Okay. Yeah, they're probably going to take the point, okay. but... Um, I don't want to just run in there and get murdered again. Come on, Makoa. Come on, buddy. Okay, he's just standing there like a fool, so... Whatever. All right, Ooh, you want the heals? There you go. Have some more. <laughs> oh yeah, there he is. There's Mokoa. There's my buddy. <laughs> oh. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. What just hit us back? <laughs> okay, we got out. Come on. Oh, that was a terrible throw. It's all right. I got you, Makoa. No, stay, stay closer to me. Oh, that was terrible. I, I went the wrong way. I'm going to die. Oh, that was... Oh, that was... Uh, that was my bad. I'm not going to lie. That was just my bad. Come on. We got a hole. So, whether we win or lose, I'm just going to post this one because... Oh, ah. Ooh, I have a special up. I love this guy's special. Here we go. Ready? <laughs> oh, it didn't hit this guy. That was the main guy I wanted to hit. Oh, that was just awful. Because um, it's not about just showing games that I win. Not blame. It's just about showing the character, really. Um, and sometimes I have just absolutely the worst games of all time. And this feels like one of those. But, hey, nonetheless, it's going to be awesome. What do you mean, good game, Makoa? Do you want heals? Get your mind in the positive side of life. Okay. Ah! I've seen games come back from worse. <laughs> All right, now it's, now it's that weird, Retreat. long 30 second Retreat. wait until things start again. <laughs> Getting used to his, uh. Point spawning in 15. What you call it? The range okay. of the arch of his regular shot is hard. Look at the drop on it. <laughs> if someone was down there, it'd be great. Like if I'm shooting at Kevin over there, I hit him easily. But trying to hit someone just straight ahead of you in any kind of distance is still difficult, even though they upped it. Up the uh, speed of those trajectories to give them a little bit better of an arch. Didn't really do that much. Whoop. Okay. Oh, wow, I got trapped. I'm trying, Pumpkin. You got it. Okay, did Makoa die already? Never still left him. I feel like I abandoned him. Oh! There you go, Pumpkin. All yours, buddy. 
have all the heals you want. Oh, I need some heals. I need some heals. I need some heals. Oh. So that is one thing. There's no emergency heal. Like, uh, with Grover, you have that emergency heal that just, like, is amazing. His ultimate is insane. Oh, well, he got blown off the edge. That's the worst. Um, with Grok, his heal, or his no. thing does damage and healing pretty okay. dang good. Uh, okay. Pips makes people okay. a chicken, not which is not a okay. heal, but it is an emergency. Definitely a good emergency move. I ain't going that way by myself. You cray cray. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, God, no. Uh, yeah, what did I expect? Um, well, Dama really doesn't have it. He's really sustained healing. Which makes it hard for me to really think that he can even still be a really fantastic group healer. But I've seen people do it. I'm just, I'm just personally terrible at it. But, you know, it is what it is. Oh, oh. Yep. Give me the heals, please. Okay, where is everybody? All right. Go. No, no, no. Don't wait back here. It's not It's not a good idea. No. Ugh. Really? Is this the kind of thing that we do? No wonder we're gonna lose. And this way a terrible, terrible round. But hopefully that gave you guys a pretty good idea of how Maldambo works, even though that was just a I know how many people watch the Paladins videos anyways. Only a few people are gonna see me lose. I enjoy doing them, though. Um, but anyways, guys, for today, I do think that is going to be it. If you guys did enjoy watching us just get absolutely brutally murdered, um, do me a favor and hit that thumbs up button. Of course, feel free to subscribe if you haven't done so already. Um, also, hit me up on all your social medias, your Twitter, your Instagram, your Facebook, and even your Google Plus, even though no one ever uses it. But like I said, for today, guys, that is going to be it. I really do appreciate you coming to hang out with me. Until next time, I will see you later.